welcome back to another episode guys um you should remember that we left off in a bit of a mess uh mobs started spawning on top of my house uh i was unprepared and it destroyed my farm and made a mess of everything basically um so we've got some uh, some tidying up work to do i did unfortunately where did those oh, those guys fall down the hole? Uh, I did af unfortunately lose um, a lot of dirt here and my pumpkin and melon seeds. Melon seeds, not so concerned about because we have enough melons for the goal, although it was a nice source of food. Um, but pumpkins, we still need another one. Now, thankfully, we do have two pumpkin seeds. So it's not all bad we, we do have enough to plant some more because we do need one more um but the first thing i'm going to do is um somebody suggested that we put um some glowstone in our roof not only for interior light but um to keep mobs from spawning on top as well so i'm going to do that right now and i think there's a spider up there as well so i think we'll go and say hi and get whoops get his string too Yeah, there it is. Oh, there's a few bones, too. So, yeah, we just want to um, dot around a few glowstone here so that it's bright enough so that mobs don't spawn. And... And that's, that's it, basically. We'll put... Uh, these here should stop them from spawning now. And it looks good to boot. These paintings are really annoying me, the the way that they um they're all dark. Oh, oh what the stupid me. But we've got a lot of cleaning up work to do as you can see guys. Everything's a bit of a mess. We do have a few more pieces of string now. Um, but I was looking at some more goals that we need to work on today and um, one of the goals is to make a dispenser for that we need a bow and arrow so we do need three pieces of string for that so I'll be sure to keep those in uh, in mind um, let's put the axe back uh, we still need to make one more red block and also somebody pointed out that is nine cooked fish not three so um, I need to catch another three I didn't realize, I just thought it was six for some strange reason. See if I can catch three real quick now. If not, then I'll uh, I'll cut it out. There's one. Come on, fishy. How did you get up there? Oh, because of that block in there. Oh, we can't have that. Oh, whoa, whoa, he nearly came out then. Got so much gunpowder, I don't know what to do with it. So these creepers are spawning now. There seems to be uh, the odd thing spawning from inside there. Oh, makes me cry every time I see this. <laughs> I still need to catch another fish. I know. Uh, another two fish, actually. I'll get those off camera, though, guys. You don't want to see me uh, fishing for uh, 20 minutes. Hmm. We need to make some more ladders because these got destroyed again. I 
think what I'm going to work on doing first of all is I'm going to move my uh, well there's a couple of things I'm going to move I'm going to move the lava uh, sorry the cobble generator and I'm going to move my infinite water source I um because I'm going to try something else on the mob spawner here just to try and make it a little bit safer. So I'll work on that, guys, and I'll bring you back in a few minutes. Welcome back guys, I've done a few um, basic uh, repairs here. I've had to uh, downsize my farm as you can see, but I've brought it out a little bit more so we can focus on growing wheat. Because uh, we do need quite a bit of that. Um, yeah, I had a little accident up, up top. Um, I got a bit close and they blew a hole in it. So I'm gonna go and sleep and uh, go to go sorry go to sleep and go and fix that. Um, I've done a few changes uh, around here aside from the farm. Uh, I've moved the tree over here out of, out of the way and I've put my water and cobble generator over here as well. The reason I've done that is because I've dug out the hole there. Now there's the one block of bedrock which I can't remove, but yeah, the drop down there is actually killing them now because it's that it's far enough. So we're all kind of good there. That's working a bit better. The drop is killing them now. So I'm gonna go around down there and get all that, all those goodies. Actually, I have to be a little bit careful that nothing's sitting on the block in the middle. But that seems to be a lot, lot safer. Yeah, the bedrock's a bit of uh, a bit of a pain. It's, it's there because um, it's your spawn point, but I've slept in a bed now, so my spawn point has changed. Uh, but I do need to go up top, as I say, and fix the big hole that they blew there. Um, I got a bit close, so we shall fix that now. See what I mean? See that big hole there? So we need to try and. Fix that. There's a good, deep, good amount of spiders up here. Another couple of ender pearls, which is awesome. Ooh, a whole bunch of ender pearls. Dang it, spiders! They're like the sheep; they just push you everywhere. Okay, let's uh, let's kill these then. Good thing they're not like the pigmen, and they don't all attack you because that would suck. Okie dokie, there's that. Fix the hole, thankfully, and we can head back down. But yeah, I think about ninety-nine percent of the time now, the mob should kill themselves as they uh, as they fall down. There's the odd one or two that's gonna drop on there, obviously. But I think what I'll do as well is make a bow and arrow. I think you know I've got so many arrows; it's about time I made one. Um, will he fall down on me? Uh, I guess not. I think he will uh, probably get pushed off if another mob falls on him anyway. 
Oh, how is there zombie meat in my farm? As long as you hold crouch, it should be good. Um, I haven't planted any more melons. I have planted uh, a pumpkin, though, because we need to... Oh, I didn't get any seeds. Uh, we need to get one more pumpkin, and then I'll take that out, and I'll probably replace it with um, sugar cane. Because I need more sugar cane than I do uh, melons right now. But yeah, I put a lot more wheat down because uh, we need to grow a bunch more of that. Another four ender pearls. That was pretty good. We need a nine more ender pearls. Let's um, let's go ahead and make two bows right now. Uh, I need some sticks, please. I'm gonna need more than that though. Okay, now a bow. Is it this way? Yes. So you've got two bows. Let's uh, turn this into wool. Not many. I think we can get three pieces, maybe. Yeah. Uh, we still do need to make one more red piece of wool. So let's uh, let's do that now as well. Before I forget. Yellow's a lot more popular than red, it seems. I'm going to need a few more red ones, though, I think, because um, oh, there's one. There's um, the, the other colors of world. There's an orange one, I think, as well. So you have to combine yellow and red to get those, I think. No shortage of yellow, anyway, that's for sure. Okay, uh, I'll get the flowers off camera. We'll be here all day otherwise. He's still sitting on that piece of bedrock. Uh, I've got one piece of bone meal. Might as well use it. Got plenty of yellow flowers now, though, that's for sure. So, let's make our last red piece of wool. Done. Okay, so we've done three of the wool goals now. And we've got two white wool spare for... The reason we've only got three yellow is because we use them for paintings, if you guys remember. Um, guess we could work on... Oh, whoops. Guess we could work on the orange ones. I think it's yellow and red makes orange. Yep. We can make two orange ones. Cool. Uh, the other thing we can do is um, uh, there's actually a few little easy ones we can do. There's one for making four redstone torches. We've already made two, as you can see. So, but we might as well um, get that out of the way. That's a pretty easy one to do. Get our redstone. There you go, there's our four redstone torches done. Um, another one is to make a note block and a dispenser. Now, it's been a while since I've made these, so you're going to have to bear with me a little bit. Um, I think a note block is just that with a redstone in the middle. Yes. We'll put that over there. And a dispenser, um, I think it's pretty much the same. But with a bow in the middle and a redstone at the bottom. Nope. What about the other way around? Nope. Oh, it's not wood. I think it's cobble. Yes, there we go. I uh, doubt I'm going to use the dispenser, but we'll pop it over there anyway. Uh, I've kept one of the bows for me. And I'll get uh, a bunch of arrows as well. Uh, what else can we do? Oh, the other thing that we can do, which I think we'll go and do right now, is we can head to the nether. There's a goal for getting um, 
a stack of soul sand. And we got a little bit of soul sand last time we were there, but we certainly didn't get a stack. Uh, let me check how much we did get, actually. Yeah, we got two. So, let me... Uh, did I have any sticks or did I use them all? I guess I used them all. Let's make um, a couple of shovels. I'll just use cobble ones. There we go, we've got three shovels. We'll head to the nether and we will uh, collect that stuff up. Uh, before I do that, I'm going to try and shoot this uh, creeper off his little stand there. <laughs> off to the nether we go. Down by the pigmen to get it. It tends to be quite low down. Oh, whoa, there's a whole load there. Uh, oh, there's some right here, actually. Let's, uh... Oop. Oh. Ah, not good. Where is he? I thought he died then with one hit. Why am I hitting him? Oh, oh, have I got two shooting me now? Yeah, this creep over here. Ah, look at that shot. Right. Okay, let's get to... Let's get to digging. Nothing really I want in the nether apart from the soul sand, so... Let's uh, stay as close as we can to the exit, as I don't want to be here longer than necessary. Bad thing, I didn't bring any food with me. And oh, they died pretty easy. Anyway, we've already got 25 pieces. We got two at home, so I won't be here long at all now. I think the gas probably helped me out. They probably blew up a, a bunch of them. Another, I think we've got the materials for it. Another, another quick goal that we can do is to create one piece of TNT. Um, now, all I've got to, I just hope, really, really hope that we have enough sand to do it. But I'm going to finish collecting this stuff up, guys. I'm going to head back to our regular world and I'll meet you there. Welcome back, guys. Uh, we've just made it back. Um, we got our soul sand we've got over a stack of it now uh what else have we got oh i finished making those n uh fish at least i think i did ah here there, there they are so there's our nine fish as promised um so another yeah so another goal that we can work on really quick is making a block of tnt i've got plenty of gunpowder and just about enough sand i think so hopefully we're okay. I hope I don't need sand for anything else because we're going to be, uh, well, out of luck, basically. Uh, I think I have one piece, yeah, I have one single piece of sand left. But we've made our TNT. Is this working? Yes, it is. And I think for the most part, they seem to be dying straight away. Like I said, the odd one or two even seems to land on there. But that's okay. Seems to be uh, a bit safer. Oh. Everything seems to be pretty much dying on impact. Woo. Woo. Yes, kind of finally working as I intended. Uh, I need to eat something or I'm going to die. So let's go and do that. Uh, 
I was thinking um, also that um, we need to make an awful lot of bread. Uh, we have two pieces? What? I thought I made more than that. I guess not. Um, I mean, we only had a few pieces of um, wheat growing before, so I guess, uh, you know, we just haven't made that much. We've got seven now. We need 20 in total. I think I'll eat this stew. And a pork chop. Um, so we still need to get a bit more bread, but I've, as I explained earlier, I've put more more wheat down now, so we should uh, get that a bit quicker. Just need one more pumpkin. As soon as that grows, then I will remove that and put um, put more reeds growing. Let's see how many um, how many books we can make quickly before this episode finishes as well. Don't have too many sugar cane, but we do have a bunch of paper already. I think, is it just three in a row? Yes. Oh, you get three pieces. Okay, I did not know that. So I may be able to make way more than I expected. Okay, I got 27. That's a lot more than I thought, to be honest. I thought it was three pieces of sugar cane was one piece of paper. But now, is it just three like that to make a book? Yes. Okay, and we've got nine books, and we also need wooden planks. Because is it, it something like that with three books in the middle? Yes. Okay, so it's three books. We still we still don't have enough, but we can make a bunch. Um, let's see. Okay, so we've made three. It's not exactly a bunch. We need 15, so we do still need quite a bit, actually. But, uh, let's put them, let's put them in our house. Why not? So we need another 12 of those. So we still got a long way to go with the old uh, sugar cane. Ah. Oh, can't get out, and I just ruined that. Um, yeah, so pretty uneventful episode. This guys have just had to clean up a lot of stuff. Um, to be honest, we're probably getting pretty close to finishing. The stuff that's left is just kind of the grinding stuff, like um, you know, collecting all the um, the reeds and the string and and that type of thing. Uh, those type of things are going to take a little while, and most of that stuff, you know, just when we're hanging around waiting for things. I will, um, you know, I'll do off camera. Don't want to bore you guys to death. Yeah, I want that ender pool. I think I'm going to build across to it. Oh, there's two there. Oh, dang it. I have to do this pretty quick, I think. There we go. There's two ender pearls. I couldn't afford to uh, to leave those go because we do need them. Although I think we're pretty close. Okay, we'll check how many more ender pearls we need, and we'll leave it there for this episode. Mob spawner um, seems to be working, and it seems to be pretty safe right now as well. Uh, Gunpowder. Yeah, we've got 14 ender pearls, so we only need six more for that as well. Alright guys, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.